outside to learn about hot classrooms in Hillsborough County. It's summer, it's Florida, and imagine sitting in a classroom with no air conditioning. News Channel 8's Amanda Shivari joining us now live from the Hillsborough County School Board with a look at where things stand now almost a week after school started here. And Amanda, there's classrooms out there that are just sweltering. Yeah, I can't imagine sitting in there and trying to focus. It's an issue we've been talking about since the very first day of class. Parents say it has only gotten worse since then. We're getting calls about this almost daily. Parents who are reaching out to us say the classrooms at Burns Middle School are so hot. The nurse had to call one mom and tell her her son nearly passed out in class due to the heat. She and other parents at the middle school have complained to the district after temperatures in the classroom were more than 85 degrees. Parents at Martinez Middle School say the classrooms there are just as hot. And for one mom, this is a health risk to her child. So if he was in a class that did not have proper AC, he could be in an emergency room. And it could be life-threatening, actually. They're soaked through their clothes. They're absolutely soaked through their clothes. I had no notification from anybody. Teachers are also posting on social media about these hot classroom district school officials say that the problem is old air conditioning units and also a maintenance funding cut by the state. But they say they are working to fix the problem as quickly as possible. But you can count on eight on your side to make sure those changes are happening and let you know as soon as everything is fixed. Yeah, Amanda, because if you're sweating and you're hot, the learning probably is not going very well when you're in that classroom. No.